Uh, blue sky and sunshine greeted the 86,000 spectators for the race at the Nürburgring. And the motorsport fans got to see quite a lot. A quadruple victory for Audi. Martin Tomczyk was the man of the weekend at the ring. With an outstanding lights to flag victory, he was able to score his first race win of the current DTM season. With his Audi A4 DTM, the Bavarian driver dominated the entire weekend. Lang was here. Um, that was a long time coming. This victory clearly rounds off a perfect race weekend. The start of the sixth DTM round at the Nürburgring provided plenty of action. On the first row, Tom Chick alongside Mercedes-Benz driver Bruno Spengler. Behind them, Audi drivers Matthias Ekström and Timo Scheider. Tom Chick's start was good. He held on to the lead. On the first corner there already was a collision. Catherine Legg turned Gary Peffert around. For the British lady racer the race was over at this time already. On the second corner Bruno Spengler comes under pressure from Matthias Ekström. Timo Scheider benefited from this situation and overtook the two of them. Spengler's AMG Mercedes C-Class got damaged in the heat of the battle but the Canadian was able to continue. Ralf Schumacher also had an excellent start. On the opening lap, the Mercedes-Benz driver moved up from 15th to 11th. On lap 6, Oliver Jarvis and Alexandre Prema felt victim to the first corner. Because of a missing rear-view mirror, Jarvis couldn't see his teammate and could not avoid the collision. Both Audi drivers retired. Ralf Schumacher bent from the retirements and made it into the points. I am indeed very happy, but I must say that the start in the situation clearly helped me, but at least I was able to keep the pace of the others today. Fellow Mercedes-Benz driver Gary Peffert started only 16th due to a technical problem in qualifying and still scored one point. Out in front, Audi drivers Tom Chick, Scheider and Ekström undisputedly drove their laps and battled it out for the podium places among each other. However, there was no way to beat Martin Tomczyk and thus he was the first to cross the finish line. Timo Scheider and Matthias Ekström followed behind him. The three-way victory for the brand from Ingolstadt was completed by Marcus Winkelhock in fourth place. The best place Mercedes-Benz driver was Jamie Green with his year-old car in fifth, who was so fast that he could even overtake his fellow Mercedes driver Bruno Spengler. I started on 11th on the grid and um, to finish fifth is a really good, good job for me. Um, the team did a really good job, they gave me a very good car. Four Audi drivers in front at the Nürburgring. A great success for Dr. Wolfgang Ulrich's team. Vier Ringe. Four rings, four Audis in front, a perfect weekend and I think that the team has done a great job. All the pit stops were perfect, the cars were well prepared. The complete result of the Nürburgring round at a glance. Martin Tomczyk won, Timo Schader second and Matthias Ekström third. The best Mercedes driver Jamie Green in fifth place. Ralf Schumacher finished seventh, Gary Peffert still scored one point. Matthias Lauda achieved his best result of the season so far by finishing ninth. The DTM point standings. Timo Scheider is leading Matthias Ekström by one point. Gary Peffert drops back to third place. The fact that we now have claimed back the points lead was a nice achievement for us over here. The exciting DTM series has its next round at Brands Hatch as ever here on DTM TV. 